What is up guys? Welcome to the channel. True Hunter here. In today's video we are on Pick a Bean Bay going after magpie geese. That is right guys. We are doing the one hour magpie slaughter. For all the new players out there asking me if the magpie setup is worth it, this is going to be your guys' go-to video in order to see it. We're going to be hunting these guys for an hour straight and I will be giving you a grand total of how many GMs we have made within that hour. And if you guys haven't seen already in the background my trusty golden retriever here. Well actually it's white but... Duck Duck Goose is going to be helping us retrieve these guys today. So we shouldn't have to leave the duck line for this. So it should be a pretty simple video. And I'll be sh playing a multiplayer so you guys can see the scores of each goose pop up on the screen as well. So let's get started. Alright guys, we made it to the blind. I'm going to explain the location of my setup and why I also have a tripod sitting right there as well. So let's go ahead and get into here. I'm going to pull my dog in here as well. We got some magpies coming in. It sounds like. I'm gonna go ahead and call these guys in. Looks like we got a flock about eight over there. But anyways, here's the setup. I got the goose blind sitting right here on this kind of a plateau area. And here we are on the map. The coordinates are exactly seven zero eight eight seven eight nine one for the x and y axis. And the reason why I choose this is because this is a direct flight pattern for the magpie geese. So there's been some times where I've sat here and killed hundreds of magpies within like a two hour span. And if you guys start in multiplayer, they actually uh, spawn sooner, so their flight patterns are a lot faster as well. And so the weapons of choice I got, I got the semi-auto 12 gauge with me. You only get three shots, but we are also using the 22 LR semi-automatic for them longer range shots. Looks like we got our first flock to break here. Long range collar to break them, short range collar to call them in closer. That is a nice sized magpie sitting there. As soon as they make that double circle, we're going to open up on them here. As soon as they get back here in front of the blind. Got one of those. We got another flock coming in. Another decent sized flock. See if we can get any of these guys to break. Now it's not guaranteed that they'll break every time. So you may have a flock like this fly over and none of them break. So that could be like because of the previously like you shooting. But Nope, we got another flock actually in front of us. We got four of these guys to break. We're getting short range collar these guys in. Get the 12 gauge and we may be able to double up here. Actually got all of them right there out of that one. Go ahead and make sure our 22 is reloaded here. We got plenty of bullets here too with us. I brought about four stacks of each, but we are really close to the tent. As you guys can see, there are just geese flying everywhere. And there are geese laying everywhere as well. Might take them a second though. Yep, one of them broke. Both of them broke. Go ahead and short range these guys in. They might give us a double shot here. them I would wait until they're about above the blind as well too if you can help it because it does make it a lot faster for your dog to go grab them we actually got a, the entire flock to come out of that one okay, let me get a little bit lower Can 
grab these guys with a 22 here. You really gotta line it up on that hitbox of them too. I'm gonna call these guys in here. Oh, this should give us a nice double kill here. Messed up my double kill though. Got them all though. So we got the entire flock to break out of that one. We got another flock coming into our left. This flock to our left probably won't break. We're gonna try to get this flock to break too. Probably won't happen. Oh, that did happen. Oh, it did happen. Oh, I'm out of bullets. I'm out of bullets. Reload. We got another flock coming in. These guys aren't landing for sure because you guys have already broken off. So this is a very nice magpie right here. That's like almost max weight is 3.9. So we, this is a actual pretty decent uh, magpie goose. We got another flock coming in. We actually managed to get all these guys to break here. There's only four of them, but still, we're gonna bust them as soon as they come around this left side. Honestly, between doing missions, this is personally my best and favorite way to get GMs fast and easy. You don't have to like, you don't have to move away from the tent or the blind. Now it does take a little bit to get this setup going, but once you get it, you can definitely pay it back. Yep, it broke. Nice. And it's two more to the pile. Send old Duck Duck Goose after him. It does tend to slow down a little bit, about 9 a.m. too, so. They're currently uh, sitting at 9.15, so we got 15 minutes in game until we are gonna do our grand total after we gather all the other stray ducks we've got. Five of them broke. Got the double. Got all of them. Nice. Hi guys, it's 9.29, almost been an hour. We got one more minute in game and we have our last flock flying overhead right now before we are going to collect the rest of the geese and tally up the total amount of GMs we've got within an hour. So hopefully this is our last flock that'll be good to us and break, because that'd be fantastic if we can get at least three or four more geese to break. Guys, we got four to break, five to break. We're gonna let these guys get a little bit closer here because this single one broke off weird. All right, 
right, that is going to be our last flock of geese for the hunt, guys. I'm going to go ahead and grab all these geese that are scattered throughout right here, and I'm going to tally up the total that we've got, and I'll show you guys at the end. All right, guys, we have the results in. I have gathered all the geese, even the ones we've shot with the 22 LR, and here are the results for a one-hour hunt of magpie. We have a total of 42 harvests at the highest GM. We've got 76 GMs. For all you guys didn't know, CSS is the amount of GMs you get for a grand total of almost 1,400 GMs for one hour at hunt. So, personally, if you guys ask me, this is a really, really well sought out method to get GMs other than missions. So, if it wasn't me, I would definitely grind for a goose setup because you can definitely get all your other gear that way. So, yeah, if you guys want to see more videos like this, I can make a part two and so we can see if we can break 42 harvests, kind of like a record, within an hour. So let me know down in the comments what you think, and I will see you guys next time.